Hey guys, real fast before the video starts, remember to enter my Tim Brown and Bob Sanders giveaway. Um, the link down below or the annotation will be on the screen or the right hand corner of the screen. You will see a card that you can click on and go to that video and see how to enter the giveaway. Now, right into your video. Hey guys, that one came back here for another video. Welcome back guys. Today we will be reviewing the new legend bundle that is out. It's 60 gold or better, 50 team items, 10 legend items, 1 gold legend player. The bundle topper obviously as you can tell is 1 gold legend player. It costs about 7500 coin of uh, points to uh do to buy this bundle. It contains 10 legend packs. Each legend pack containing six golds or better, five team items, one legend item, and of course bundle topper added into that. Now uh, the comparison is going to be the pro packs, obviously 50 pro pack bundle, 50 golds or better, 100 silvers or better, 150 bronzes or better, and 200 team items. Now if you guys have not seen my uh, pro pack opening, go check it out, my bundle, my pro pack bundle. Um, from opening that, I found out one thing. Silvers and bronzes really add up, guys. So, I'm going to say the pro packs are better because of the fact silvers and bronzes make m made me more coins than the golds. And that's no joke. Like, honestly, silvers and bronzes make you a lot of freaking coins. So, I recommend you go to the pro packs here. Bundle's not worth it. But definitely watch the gold players, the gold legend players. See how the price fluctuates. See you guys in the next one. Peace out. Hey guys, that House of Gaming back here for another video. Guys, Super Bowl 52. Carolina made it again, guys. So, as you guys know, they made it three years in a row. They lost two years back to back. Now, hopefully, we're hoping to give them the third loss in a row. And, you know, that would be awesome because then we could... um. Maybe next year play them and go, they could go 4 0 and then beat the Buffalo Bills and go, then go 5 0. Who knows? But here is your Carolina Panthers, guys, for Super Bowl 52, being led by no other than Cam Newton, one of the best quarterbacks right now. And now let's look at your Baltimore Ravens being led by Joe Flacco, a rookie running back. And a whole bunch of other beasts. And Marshall Yonda. Also Dwayne right there. And it's very interesting to see. Um, obviously, you know, Carolina keeps getting back here. They keep losing. And it's not going to be easy playing a team that has that kind of record. Because of the fact that, you know, they're so hungry for the win right now, guys. They're so hungry to take this W and just take the win away from us. That... You know, they're going to do anything they can right now to win. So, oh, with um, Stuart injury, we saw Wizard, uh, uh, Foxy Wizzaker, I can say names, right? We saw him shine, okay? So, we saw him being able to be that halfback, kind of like Stuart is, and, you know, take the over the role as the main running back. And although it is very difficult to, you know, be able to do it, uh, to look around everything because of the fact that, the man, the man has two running backs. I mean, Panthers have two running backs, let's be honest. Yeah, they have Jonathan Stewart, and then they have Cam Newton. So, now with um, Stewart out and Fozzie Whitaker is now the main running back, you still have Cam Newton. So, obviously it's going to be a running back by committee, which is kind of sad to say, because that's a quarterback you're looking at, and it's running back by committee for that reason. That's Kind of stupid, but it's how it is. Um, Amir Abdullah has a foot injury. Uh, initial x-rays came back negative on Sunday. Uh, free press reports test showed a sprain, but Abdullah is visiting Dr. Robert Andrews for a second opinion. Although Theo Widrick is the main back.